I am obsessed with this thing called mutual grooming in horses. And it's the original reason why I went to vet school, because I wanted to know the physiological reason why it happens. But these two horses are grooming each other in the paddock, and seamlessly they switch sides, which just fascinates me. I've got two more clips of two more mutual groomings. And this may get boring after a while, but to me, it gets the essence of the horse. Their ability to communicate with each other and to, uh, and to help each other out. Now, honestly, it was difficult for me to get, find mutual grooming horses because it seems to be a very personal thing. And I'm a stranger, so this is obviously from a distance. So I had some clients look out for me and, and send in some videos of their own horses. And this is one of them. These two go at it, and go at it, and go at it. And they're actually pretty aggressive. Look at that Connemara up front, just digging those upper incisors into that gray pony's neck, just going at it. And what's really funny is, there's some sort of communication that goes on, like, can you move, can you get this spot, can you, but there's not a lot. I mean, when somebody starts scratching my back, I want them to move all over. It's like the itches when you start scratching move to different spots. These guys seem pretty happy going to one spot. They're almost in a trance. They aren't even aware of who's around them. Oh, well, maybe the horse said, well, who are you? What do, what do you? Oh, yeah, I know who you are. I'm going to go back and just start rubbing some more. And so they go right to it. And then at some point, the gray horse here says, well, I think I've had enough and just uh, walks away. Yep, that's it. I'm gone. And this next clip, it's obviously a smaller frame. I apologize for that. But these two are going right at it. What I want you to see is the transition where they go to the, each other's other side of the neck. And it's almost like the gray horse is leading the way. Looks here, then it will dip the head down for the shoulder now but it's almost in the blink of an eye they'll be on each other's side watch it it's coming wink just like that just like that they switch sides and what's really fascinating is there's no argument there's no discussion there's no, 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 you, got, you can't do that. Just one of them suggests it, the other one says, okay, and away they go. I used to scratch the horse's neck, and they would do that phlegm and lip curl and curl around, and they would start to mutually groom me, which just hurts, so I won't allow it. But it's still fascinating to me. What's the connection? I wanted to know in my anatomy class what the innervation is, the nerves that go back there. And they never showed them to me. There was no book that said that's where it is. Oh, there goes the switch. See? Isn't that cool? And then I found out that, well, it just feels good. I know when somebody scratches my back, that's it. I'm just like in heaven. I can't even move. I think that's what it's all about. These horses just feel good with each other. And they're just scratching each other's back, showing respect, showing that there's no animosity that this thing is just, well, what life is all about. That, and of course, eating. 